Hello everyone, welcome to Aptitude Jab. This set from CAT 2018, slot 1 DILR, says that an ATM dispenses exactly 5000 per withdrawal using 100, 200, and 500 rupee notes. The ATM requires every customer to give her preference for one of the three denominations of notes. It then dispenses notes such that the number of notes of the customer's preferred denomination exceeds the total number of notes of other denominations dispensed to her. Now, <clears throat> based on this, we have to answer the following questions. The first question is, in how many different ways can the ATM serve a customer who gives 500 rupees notes as her preference? So we have 100, 200 and 500 rupee notes. We need to get a total of 50, that is 5000. Okay, so the best, like we have to give 500 rupees note as the preference. So first we will give 10 maximum, 10, 0, 0, right, total is 50, satisfied. Now, if the person gives 9 as the, uh, like and 500 note as the preference, maximum 10 we have taken, 9 if we take, we need to distribute 500 more. So we can give 202 notes and 101 note, this is satisfied. We can have one note of 200 and three notes of 100. That is also satisfied. Okay. Then we can also have 900, nine notes of 500, no note of 200 and five notes of 100. See, the total number of notes of these two types should be less than this. So five plus zero is less than nine. Right. So that is satisfied. Now next come to eight notes of 500. Now if you have eight notes of 500, you need, uh, we will try to give minimum uh, uh, like 5 here, 5 we can give max, like 1000 rupees, this is 4000, okay, and this will give you 1000 rupees, so that will make a case because the total is less than 8. If we take 8 and we reduce our 200 rupee note, so in order to make up for one 200 rupee note, we have to bring 2 notes of 100 rupees, like 800 plus 200, that will make 1000. Now this is 6 notes and this is 8 notes less, so fine. Next 8 and if we make 3 notes here, that is 600, we need 4 notes here. This is less than 8. Now if we reduce it to 2, uh, like 2, so we need 6 notes here. Now this becomes equal. It says that the number of, it says the number of notes of the customer's preferred denomination exceeds the total number of notes of other denominations. So it should exceed. Now it is equal, right? So similarly, we can logically say that seven is not possible because if you take seven here, uh, 3,500 is done. We need to make 1,500. So at least we will note seven plus one. Okay, 700 plus seven of 200 and one of 100. So that is not possible. So because it, it is less than the given number. So we have just these cases, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven such cases. If the ATM could serve only 10 customers with a stock of 50, 500 rupee notes and a sufficient number of notes of other denominations, what is the maximum number of customers among these 10 who could have given 500 rupee notes as their preference? So there are customers, 10 customers, they have to be served. There are 50 notes of 500. Okay, there are 50 notes of 500. We need to serve maximum number of customers. So if you have to serve maximum customers, that means you give minimum 500 rupee notes per customer. So minimum per five rupee, 500 rupee notes per customer is eight, as we saw in the previous question. Okay, so if you give 8 and there are 50 nodes, so you can serve 6 customers. Okay, now if you try to give more nodes, let us say if you give five no 9 nodes per customer, you would be able to serve only 5 customers. Okay, if you give 10 rupee nodes, 10 500 rupee nodes, you will be able to serve only 5 customers. So you have to serve maximum customers, that means you need to give minimum 500 rupee nodes per customer. So per customer, if you give 8 500 rupee nodes, you can serve 6 customers. What is the maximum number of customers that the ATM can serve with a stock of 50, 500 rupee notes and a sufficient number of notes of other denominations 
if all the customers are to be served with at most 20 notes per withdrawal. Okay. So all customers should be given maximum of 20 notes per withdrawal. Okay. Now we need to give, uh, we have 5500 rupee notes and we need to serve maximum customers. So what we will do, we will give minimum 500 rupee notes per customer. We will try to give minimum 500 rupee notes per customer. Now total notes are less than 20, right? At most. So total notes are less than or equal to 20. So let us think this, think this manner. Like if you give 220 rupee notes, uh, 20 notes of 200 rupees, you are serving 4000 rupees, right? So that means you cannot give 20 notes here. So you have to give less than 4000 in this amount. Okay. So if you take this case like 1000 and uh, 4000, it is not possible. Now, if we give three notes of 500, okay, three notes of 500, we have already given 1500. We need to give 35 more. So we need to give 17 plus one that again makes more than 20. So this is also not possible. So we were talking that minimum 500 notes per customer. We cannot give two, two notes per customer because for that we need to give 20 notes of 200, which exceeds the number of notes. If we give three notes per customer, then we need to give at least 20, 70 notes of this type and one of this type. We cannot serve the customers. So if we give four, is it possible to serve the customers? Four notes you have given, you have already given 2000 rupees. Okay, you need to give 3000 more, 300 more. So if we give 15 notes, yes, that is possible. So this is a possible scenario. So minimum 500 rupees notes per customer is four. Okay, so per customer you have to give four notes and there are 50 notes of 500. So 50 divided by 12, uh, 50 divided by four, we get 12 as the answer. We can serve 12 customers. We cannot serve beyond that. What is the number of 500 rupee notes required to serve 50 customers with 500 rupee notes as their preference and another 50 customers with 100 rupee notes as their preferences if the total number of notes to be dispensed is the smallest possible, okay? The total number of notes is smallest possible. So how will have total number of notes possible? So 500, try to give as many possible, as many cases, as many notes as possible. Okay, try to give 500 because if you have to give less notes, you need to give more notes of 500. Now, when you have the preference of 500 and in this case, we have a preference of 100. So in this scenario, we will use the case 10, 0, 0, okay, because uh, we try to give minimum notes. We need to dispense the smallest possible number of notes and we have to give 50 customers. The question is asking number of 500 rupee notes. So in this case, we are giving 500 notes of 500 rupees. Now preference is 100. We need to try to give maximum notes of 500. So we will not give any note of 200. Okay. We need to give only in 1 and 500. Right. If we give 9 notes here, we can give only 5 notes of, notes of 100 rupees. So that is not possible. If we give 8 notes here, then we can give 10 notes of 1000, 100. So that is a possibility because this is the preference of 100. We are giving the least number of nodes. Total number of nodes should be smallest possible. So if you have to take smallest number of nodes, maximum 500 rupee nodes should be given. Now we have 50 such customers. So we will be giving 400 rupee nodes of 500 rupees. So in this case, 500 plus 400, total 900 nodes of 500 should be distributed to the customers. So this was the solution to the set and the answers to the questions.